Get strong. What's up, J2R family? We're back again. I'm Johnny. I'm Jeremiah. And today we're back to NF Happy. But before you subscribe, if you're not part of J2R family or it's your first time on our channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Patreon. If you haven't seen our previous reaction to NF, put a card up here in the link in the description below. You guys check those out. Uh, so this is Happy. What do you think about this? I'm thinking about is he going to be talking about how he's happy now. You know what I'm saying? Maybe he, I know NF has went through a lot of stuff in his life and everything like that. I listened to a lot of his music and everything. You know what I'm saying? Growing up, like uh, his mom being a drug addict, stuff like that. You know what I mean? And uh, I know he's just been through a lot, just in general. You know what I mean? So maybe like he's finally found like this happiness in his life to where like he can actually like sit there and make like more music that's like uh, like happy, I guess you could say. You know what I mean? Because I feel like most of his music is like kind of darker, like sad stuff like that. You know what I mean? So maybe he's found a place in his life to where he can actually like make a different type of music. No, I'm gonna go up, something like that. I hope you're right. Uh, I'm gonna go a little bit different. I'm gonna go where this video is more like uh, where he's like continuously on the pursuit of happiness. He's okay, always okay. searching for it. Sometimes, like when it's right there in front of him, he still can't find it. Okay. So that's what I'm thinking. All right. So we will see what happens in the opposite video. Oh, yeah. Dear God, please hear me out. I know it's this looks like almost like a part two of How Could You Leave Us, by the way the video is coming up. I know like you haven't watched the video yeah. or whatever, but it's like a really fucking sad song by him because like he talks about how his mom died from overdosing. So this one kind of looks like I could be wrong, like before that even happened. Dear God, please. Hear me out, I know it's been a couple years Since I've reached Out and said hello, I bet you're wondering Why I keep Obsessing on and stressing all the little things When I should be Living life and soaking up the memory I know I've been selfish I have no excuse to give you it's true Hanging by a thread how I live I don't know why but I feel more comfortable Living in my agony Watching my self-esteem go up in flames acting Happy. This is a sad ass song right here. It really bro. is. Like it's very upbeat, but like sad as shit. You know what I'm saying? Just uh, everything that's going on in the video and everything. You know what I mean? Knowing everything that NF has went through and everything, it's like he he wants to be happy, but it's like he can't move past everything. You know what I'm saying? That he's went through or whatever. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's kind of. I think maybe it scares him maybe to be happy. You know what I mean? I don't know, but it's just crazy as hell how he's just kind of living in his sorrows and everything he's went through and everything like that. Oh, sure, yeah. You know, this video so far, it's like really, it's, it's really sad, you know, watching him as the kid, like, take care of himself. Yeah. You know, it, it really sucks to see that. And and maybe the reason why he doesn't, can't be happy is because once he's happy, then he can lose it. Yeah, that's a good possibility. Yeah, I didn't think about it that way. Trapping. The truth is I need help, but I just can't imagine who I'd be. I was happy, yeah. Been this way so long, it feels like something's off when I'm not depressed. I got some issues that I won't address. I got some baggage I ain't open yet. I got some demons I should put to rest. I got some traumas that I can't forget. I got some phone calls I've been avoiding. Some family members I don't really connect with. Some things I said I wish I would have not let slip. Some hurtful words that never should have let my lips. Some bridges burn. I'm not ready to rebuild yet. Some insecurities I haven't dealt with yet. I'll be the first to admit that I'm a lonely soul. And the last to admit I need a hand to hold Losing hope, headed down a dangerous road Strange I know, but I feel most at home When I'm living in my agony Watch That's a fucking, bro, this shit sad as fuck, bro 
You know what I'm saying? Just like, and just the way he connected all those fucking bars, which is insane. You know what I'm saying? Obviously, everybody yeah. knows NF is a fucking lyricist. His his mind goes forever and ever. You know what I mean? But just the way he connected all that, it was just crazy as hell. You know what I mean? It's like he's just living. Obviously, he's, he says he's living in his agony and everything like that. Yeah, obviously, he just can't get over it. You know what I mean? He feels better when he lives through that. True. Like lives that way. You know what I mean? That's just crazy. That probably he probably probably feels it makes him stronger. Yeah. I need a hand to hold, losing hope, headed down a dangerous road. Strange, I know, but I feel most at home when I'm living in my agony, watching my self esteem go up in flames, acting like I don't care what anyone else thinks. When I know truthfully that that's the furthest thing from how I feel, but I'm too proud to open up and ask you. Happy. It's crazy. Don't know what's around the bend. Don't know what my future is. But I can't keep on living in. Living in my agony. Hey, okay. Watching myself esteem go up in flames, acting like I don't. Care what anyone else thinks when I know truthfully that that's the furthest thing from how I feel. But I'm too proud to open up and ask you to pick me up and pull me out this hole I'm trapped in. The truth is I need help, but I just can't imagine who I'd be if I was happy. Hey. I was happy. Huh. I wonder what that ending was about. Huh. That was interesting. I like he switched up the he switched up the lyrics at the end, you know what I'm saying? He said he can't keep living in uh this agony, you know what I'm saying? And like he just kinda kept going from there or whatever. So I wonder if he's trying to find happiness. Obviously I know I think his new album is called like uh what is his new I think it's called Happy? Happiness? Something like that. I'm, I'm not sure exactly what it's called, but uh, it's pretty cool like how he switched up the lyrics whatever he's actually searching for happiness now because just because of everything he's went through, you know what I mean? But this is an amazing song. It really is. I mean the lyrics and everything the way it went went it was just amazing. I mean obviously he, he's a fucking lyricist like I said earlier and just the way he connected the bars is just unbelievable. I mean I like his singing too. His, his singing just sounded amazing. Yeah, yeah. It really really did. The chorus was just amazing. It was a very well put together video. Not sure. I'm, I'm assuming that was probably like maybe like him and his mom when he was younger or something like that. But it was just a crazy video. It really was. It went perfectly with the song and everything. And uh, he's just an amazing storyteller just in general. But hopefully it ended up does find that happiness that he's looking for, you know what I mean? But what you think, Johnny? That was just a ridiculously sad video. Just even if it didn't have lyrics, just watching the video itself, you could see what was going on and it would just make you sad. But then adding the lyrics to it about, you know, him living in his agony and like, you know, having to go on and, you know, like, like he was taking care of himself, yeah. you know, throughout the video. That's just like sad to watch. And it's, it's really good to see that, you know, he has come this far from where he was. Yeah. You know, it's, it's maybe he's not happy. But at least he's made something of himself. For sure. So so that's definitely a positive there. And and you know, I don't know as much about NF as, as Jeremiah does, but he's an amazing artist. He really is. He's definitely a lyricist. And I love every every song I've heard of his is just amazing. It really is. And I look forward to, to watching more of his videos and listening to more of his songs because he's an amazing artist. He really is. Yeah, but I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. If you did, make sure you hit the like button. If you're not part of J2R family, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Make sure you check us out on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, TikTok, and Patreon.